in Acts chapter 16 and verse uh, 13. It says, on the Sabbath day, we went to the city to the riverside where prayer was customarily made. We sat down and spoke to the women who met there and a certain woman named Lydia heard us. She was a seller of purple from the city of Thyatira who worshiped God. The Lord opened her heart to heed the things spoken by Paul. And when she and her household were baptized, she begged us saying, if you have judged me to be faithful to the Lord, come to my house and stay. So she persuaded us. Here we are right at that very river. This is the, the river that flows through Philippi and it is right here next to this beautiful baptistry that was built just for pilgrims. And it's a lovely Greek Orthodox church there. That's the Acropolis of Philippi. This is one of the bridges over the river. And right there is the cross-shaped baptistry covered with leaves. It's just a, a lovely sight to remember. The Lord opens hearts. Uh, the Lord sent Paul to share the gospel in this place. And this woman, Lydia, who was a businesswoman, who was from far away Thyatira, right here by this river, heard the gospel and came to faith in Christ. What a blessing to know God has divine appointments for all of us. And I hope that as you go through life, that you say, Lord, I want to be your servant. I want a divine appointment to share the gospel. You know whose hearts you're opening. You know those who are sitting by riversides waiting. They, they're seeking you because you're just an arm's length away from everyone and you know their hearts. Boy, the greatest thrill in life for me is getting to lead people to Christ. Right here at the river at Philippi, right here in Acts 16, I ask you, who are you taking with you to heaven? I hope that you're asking the Lord for some divine appointments and that you will be able to lead some of these Lydia's in life to faith in Christ. John Barnett, Life and Lessons of Paul, Study, Journey, as we look at Philippians and Acts 16.